This is Transformers Dark of the Moon Cyberverse Legion Class Autobot Ratchet. Uh, here's a quick look at the packaging. Horrible, horrible packaging. I'm not a big fan of the Cyberverse packaging. They just suck. Difficult to open. Aesthetically, it just doesn't appeal to me. And I will keep saying that for every Cyberverse figure I review. Now, the figure is an absolute waste of money. Um, the only reason I picked this guy up was because it was on 60% markdown clearance. And that was the only price I was willing to give up to actually get this figure. The only thing going for it is it's got some pretty nice um, paint apps and a wonderful, um, very simplistic transformation, which is quite friendly to the kids. Articulation-wise, thing sucks. Look at the... I mean, the shoulder is way too high. It's just a hinge joint. Who gives... I mean, who who makes hinge joints for shoulders? I mean, look at that. Uh, it's got a ball-jointed elbow that just goes here, but if you want to make it move forward, and his palms are facing up like that. It just sucks. Uh, no waist articulation, no head articulation. Oh, well, he can look down, but because that's because of transformation. Uh, still sucks. He, 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 he's got a ball-jointed hip, and that's about it. Uh, his shoulders can go in and out because of transformation, but that's not really part of the articulation. Uh, his left hand can hold a weapon. Um, it's a 2 millimeter weapon, I think. No, 2 or 3 millimeter weapon. Um, he can hold it. Uh, peg. So, interesting details on him. Very cool. Uh, you get some nice paint apps, as, I, as I've mentioned. Uh, but the figure is just not worth the retail price it's going for. For clearance price, uh, at clearance price, it, it's okay. I mean, you know, $4. Can't hurt you, right? Okay. Uh, transform him. Um... Yeah, move it up. I didn't even bother reading the instructions for the transformation. This thing is very easy and straightforward. You can do it without reading the instructions. Uh, th that is not to say that I trashed the instructions. Um, they're just there in the bin. Uh, so just uh, put it like that. And that, there you go. There is Autobot Ratchet in his uh, H2, H3. H2 uh, mode. It's a quite a big improvement. Sorry, it's a bit a little bit delayed. Um, let me just transform him back since he's very easy to transform anyway. Um, quite simply, just like that. Okay, he's a big improvement from his uh, the old uh, Legends class. This one was really horrible. A Legends class, uh, a ratchet. I think it, they used the same mold for movie one and Revenge of the Fallen. Big and big improvement. And as I said, you know, paint apps are great. Uh, this one is obviously not the original colors. It's a Desert Tracker Ratchet. But even so, the whole mold and design of the figure, um, this one is still better, definitely. So again, let me just see. Let's show both of them in, a, in their alt mode. Come on now. There's a Dark of the Moon Ratchet, and this one, okay, what about this way, and, okay, quite just horrible, horrible transformation, I mean, obviously they've, they've shrunk even the Legends class, Legion class, I apologize, come on, focus, okay, uh, Still, if you if you do need a, a pocket-sized ratchet, this is the figure that you want to get, not this one. Uh, would I recommend getting this figure? Definitely not. Uh, if you like the scale, you like ratchet, why not? But don't get it. I, I suggest to just wait for it on clearance. Don't get it. Don't pay the retail price for it. It's not worth the retail price. I honestly thought that it was going to be a good figure. I'd actually put it on my list as the ones to get on retail, but decided... Uh, I, in hindsight, it's a good decision to just wait for it on clearance, and I'm glad I did. 
uh, he's probably gonna be he's probably gonna be gonna be staying in this mode for our majority of the time. There you go, folks. Uh, very disappointing. Uh, Transformers, Dark of the Moon, Cyberverse, Legion class, Autobot, Ratchet. Thanks for watching.